What is up, everybody? Azaru here, and welcome to the ADS Play uploading schedule for the week of November 17th, going into the week of Christmas. We are going into November 23rd. Turn this down a little bit. So, with that being said, man, it's going to be a lot of downtime coming up this week. You know, it's time to spend with family, enjoy some good food, and all that good stuff. But here on ADS Play, you know, the ball is going to keep rolling, and we got some exciting news. In regards to some things that I've been working on in the, in the background, you know, I've, I've been kind of keeping quiet about it, as well as uh, some changes to some sites that I usually, usually use that I'm getting ready to revamp and, um, and relaunch, uh, and just update you guys on all the games that I'll be playing for this week, as well as everything that I've finished. So as you see right now, I'm on ABS Play, my channel, and I've finished playing Dead Rising 4, Frank's Book Package, I'm actually going to do a review of that game, so you guys keep an eye out for that. I haven't done too many reviews, but going into 2018, that's one of my plans to pick reviews back up again, and to get back into that, because that was an element for my channel that I was really missing, and they're not going to be fancy videos or anything like that, it's just going to be me giving my opinions bare bones, because it doesn't make any sense for me to do a lot of heavy editing and not, not a lot of people gonna come watch the video I feel until my views get more consistent on my videos then I'll do it but until then I'm just gonna give my thoughts whether or not the game was good what the poor parts of the game was what the highlights of the game were you know give a real informative review without all the extra nonsense but uh, yeah most definitely I finished Frank's big package um, I did three live streams three long live streams and, um, you know, I enjoyed it for the most part, but there were some things we got to talk about. Uh, I released a video, a, the first of many, of my Let's Discuss series. Now, the Let's Discuss series are about gaming news, um, questions I may have had about the gaming community, gaming companies, and, you know, just anything related to gaming. And the first of those many questions, the um, first of those many videos were, are fighting games too beginner friendly? And you guys can check that video out. It's right there. You see it right there. Um, click on it. Tell me what you guys think. Start a discussion. Feedback. Leave a, uh, a comment. You know, subscribe. And, uh, be more and be updated on whenever I release videos like that. Um, next, I want to give a shout out to all 1,976 of my subscribers because that number has went up this year. I mean, I was like. 1300 subscribers and then it jumped up by yeah about like a good 400 or like a good 576 this year so I'm not complaining about that at all it's, it's an organic growth and I enjoy it and most definitely you know salute to everybody that that uh that in uh that has come to the channel and wants to see it succeed Next up, I played my first game of Smite last night. It was just a late night session, you know, I was playing the game. I didn't know what Smite was. PlayStation Plus members got like a free package from the PlayStation Network and I downloaded it. But I'm like, you know what, let me just check the game out. And it plays a lot like League of Legends, which is a game that I play often. And, you know, but it's different dynamics. I don't know about the items too much, so... Last night I did my first session of Smite. I played two matches, and I'm not afraid that I got my ass kicked. <laughs> it was pretty bad, but um, the two matches that I played in that video was actually my second and third time playing the game. My first time I actually won, but the second and third time ugh, I got bodied. But um, the most definitely it was a uh, it was a learning curve, and I'm going to be playing more of that. So I hope you guys join me for those streams. So again, like, comment, subscribe, be informed of when the next video comes up, hit that alert button, whatever the hell the alert button is, or did they take it off? I don't know, it's crazy, but that's neither here nor there. So, as I was saying, Frank's Big Package, I do have a video review of this game coming this week. Stay tuned, keep your eyes and ears open, subscribe to the channel, be informed, uh, uh, the game Tokyo Xanadu now this game uh, I was supposed to be receiving it in the mail from Gamefly apparently it got down to low availability 
which means I probably won't be seeing it for a while, which is cool because nobody expected me to play the game anyway. There was no big promotion for the game. There wasn't anything major. So it wasn't anything I was, you guys are going to miss anyway. But when I do get it, I will be playing it. Um, the World Warriors Collective uh, eSports uh, shirts. The campaign is still going on. Even though the initial campaign is like done, you can still get a t-shirt. So don't worry. If you go to the, the Teespring website and you can't, you know, when you see that it says you, you still want one, the reserve now button is not there. But if two or more, you know, when two more orders get, the campaign will relaunch once at least one more person orders a t-shirt. So it's not like you guys will, won't be able to get one now. You can still get one. Head to teespring.com. Um, slash World Warriors Collective that's collective without the E as you see it spelled right there and grab your t-shirt and rep the warrior in you the World Warriors Collective team, uh, Collective is my esports team that I created right now I'm the only member I'm planning on promoting this uh, in 2018 going to various tournaments hopefully you guys see me on like Team Spooky stream or whatever tournament stream they have going on hopefully you guys see me on that I'm playing everything from Tekken 7 Street Fighter 5 um, I may get it, may or may not get into King of Fighters 14. Haven't really decided yet. Uh, just any fighting game or any competitive game I can get my name out there on. So most definitely, uh, check that out. And Blue Reflection. I'm trying to beat Blue Reflection as much as possible, but they got little tasks in the game that just make it difficult for you to just advance in the story the way you need to. And they haven't even unlocked all the items on the menu yet. And I'm like on chapter 6. Supposedly it's like 12 chapters in the game. So I'm really going to have to be on my grind with this. But, you know, it, it's a very tedious game. Just for you to advance in the storyline, they have you doing all these little mini missions in between. Where you got to go gather up enough points, then you got to report it, then you can advance in the story. You know, it's, it's stupid. So I'm, I'm going to have something to say about that when I review this game. So keep your eyes open for that. Uh, next up, and this is where the important stuff come in. Uh, I, I have relaunched my Patreon page. Now, for many of you, you guys know. You guys know. You guys know. I am not a person to do crowdfunding websites. I've tried to do them in the past, and they failed only because I never promoted them. And the reason why I never promoted them is that when I do a crowdfunding page, it's like when, if you guys are, you know, donating money or doing things like that for me, and I want you guys to get something in return. You know, I mean, I always appreciate those who just donate and just do it just because they want to see the channel grow. They want to help me get the equipment that I need because I do need new equipment um, in order to um, in improve the visual quality and to do the interactive live streams, which I am uh, announcing on the Patreon page. Uh, that's what I, I'm launching this campaign for. Um, I always wanted you to get more out of your money. You know, I see all these other people using Patreon and they just begging for money and things like that. And you're not getting nothing out of it for whatever reason. Maybe you are. I don't know. But I'm not seeing anything you guys are getting out of it. So, when I relaunched this Patreon page, I relaunched it with the supporter in mind. Meaning that I now have an implemented, I have implemented a rewards program, which I'm going to go into further detail in its own video um, coming this week as well. So you guys keep an eye out, subscribe to the channel uh, so you guys can see that video when it pops up in your, uh, in your subscription box. So be informed on that. Now Twitch, this is a website that I have been using off and on this year. Um, in 2018 I'm gonna try to use it more because the footage from the Twitch I still want to upload it to my YouTube channel and there's not, at least not to my knowledge forgive the background noise you guys know that where I live it's it's always something going on but with Twitch I still want to upload that footage to my YouTube channel and it's not that I can't do it is that this laptop cannot handle the programs where if I'm live streaming on Twitch I can still take that video I was live streaming on Twitch record it and then put it on my YouTube channel later on uh, once that stream is finished so it's just the campaign for the Patreon is going to be very important 
to getting the hardware and equipment that I need in order to function the way I need to in order to make this channel a success. And, you know, this isn't just some some nonsense or some dilly dally. I'm really trying to make something happen with this. So, uh, last but not least, Streamlabs. You know, you guys, for those who want to donate on Streamlabs, you can do just that. My Twitter, it's also on the banner. You guys can check that out as well. And subscribe again to ABS Play, A hyphen DS Play, the way you see it spelled right here, 101, A hyphen DS Play 101. That is the channel name. So, that is everything, man. I hope you guys enjoy it. I got a lot more coming this week. Just stay tuned for everything. It's the end of year series, so you want to see some year-end videos coming up this week, uh, this week and next week as well. So just keep your eyes open, keep your ears open, subscribe to the channel, be informed, have some fun with me, stay in tune for the live streams. It's a lot of exciting stuff I have coming. You don't want to miss it. Even the background music. You hear the background music? I'm doing little things little things to add up you know what i'm saying to make everything more interesting so hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope it was informative subscribe to the channel and uh i'll see you guys for gameplay this week until then peace and continue to rep the warrior in you